Kids in war-torn Afghanistan have found a way to ease their pain through music. Because of an American musician, children in Kabul are not only getting guitar lessons, they're also learning how to express themselves. They play tunes from Bob Marley to Pink Floyd. Strumming their acoustic guitars and singing along with their teacher has become a routine for the children at the Miraculous Love Kids School in Kabul. American guitarist Lenny Cordola decided to start the guitar school in 2010. He raised funds in the US, then moved to Kabul and opened it in February. He hopes making music can help people mend in a country that has been suffering war for almost 40 years. You know, music is a a healing force, it's a peacemaking force, it's a way to communicate things without even having to know languages. It's sort of a transcendent uh, way of communication and it's something that can get straight into the heart. Cordola has 50 students and most of them are girls. Some used to sell handcrafts, clean cars or beg on the streets. Cordola offered them money so they could get an education. Now, they take guitar lessons twice a day and go to public schools. I wish for peace and stability in Afghanistan, and I also urge the people to encourage girls to learn guitar so they can become a better future for Afghanistan. Cordola moved to Kabul after hearing the stories of Parwana and Korshid, two sisters who were killed in a suicide attack four years ago while selling textiles and crafts on the streets. Now, their younger sister, Mursal, who survived the attack, is one of Cordola's students. Her ambition is to become a guitarist, but the pain remains. Playing guitar really makes me happy and it takes me to my dream world, but it cannot ease the pain of losing my two sisters. Studies show kids who learn music are healthier, happier and have higher brain functions than children who don't learn music. A music school might sound like a luxury in a war zone, but it has actually given the kids a safe place to express themselves and a reason to move on.